I knew that the only way to succeed was to forget about home and my wife, son, and daughter, said Jordan. I found I can't do that. They're woven into the fabric of my heart and soul. Alone in a remote area, Jordan was participating in a reality show where contestants are asked to survive outdoors with minimal supplies for as long as possible. What forced him to forfeit was not the grizzly bears, freezing temperatures, injury, or hunger, but an overwhelming loneliness and desire to be with his family. We might have all the survival skills necessary for the wilderness, but separating ourselves from community is a sure way to fail. The wise author of Ecclesiastes said, two are better than one because one can help the other up. Christ honoring community, even with all its messiness, is essential to our thriving. We don't stand a chance against the trials of this world if we try to tackle them on our own. Someone who toils alone, toils in vain. Without community, we're more susceptible to danger. Unlike a single thread, a cord of three strands is not quickly broken. The gift of a loving, Christ-focused community is one that not only provides encouragement, but also gives us strength to thrive despite challenging situations. We need each other.